history of the traveling showgirl is long and rich. Since the development of the modern circus, acrobatic arts have been borrowed, exchanged, and developed. Around 1860, acrobatic arts became exotic. Some things have changed. These showgirls, who identify as featured performers, come into the profession from a variety of avenues. From pole fitness, traditional burlesque, modeling, adult video, the circus, and house girls. The performances are varied as well. They incorporate elements from traditional burlesque and sideshow circus, as well as cultural and pop icons and characters from movies and television. There were signs. It popped in my head, she's killing herself. Everything became very symbolic. I should have noticed, you know, that something was happening I did it. Hello, I am producer Simone Davis. And I'm director Freddie Graves. In the five years that we have been documenting this community, we have grown to love and respect these hardworking, dedicated women. And Veda was with us from the beginning. Before committing suicide, she conveyed that showgirls are people and that their stories are important. Without this project, their stories would never be told. Veda and many featured performers told us that Peeled is the voice of their community. Since losing Veda, we have continued to make the film. And thus far, we have filmed numerous competitions, interviewed the top organizers in the industry, and interviewed dozens of performers. Now we need funds to wrap up our final interviews cover the rest of the competitions for this year and get into post-production. So please help us tell their stories, the stories of these incredible performers who have taken an ancient art form and made it their own, both new and reinvented. Performers are people and their stories are important and their stories need to be told. <laughs>